If you could make one law for the entire planet, what would it say? I'd make the Boy Scout tradition of leaving it better than you found it mandatory. Visits the Sistine Chapel. Well, H. Monsieur I guess I could paint a little handlebar mustache on David. People like mustaches. Edit. Yes. David. A scene depicting David and Goliath is painted on the Sistine Chapel ceiling as well. Not to be confused with the statue of David. I should have gone for Adam I guess. Crime is illegal. It's big brain time. Political statements from government servants must be made under oath. Lying to the public is grounds for immediate removal from office. Greater than this would be very fun to watch. Before entering somewhere, let the people exit first. Especially important during sex. Be excellent to each other. I'd sign a bill to get this made a law. You know how judges used to have to wear those big wigs while holding court. I think they still do in some places. Well, I'd replace that with a helicopter cap. We had one of these hats in Club Penguin, didn't we? I am sure they're both there. Don't piss all over the toilet seats of public bathrooms. That's fine, I needed a shit anyway. Don't be a dick, cunt it is. Or asshole for our non-binary friends. God damn, I'm glad Reddit isn't responsible for making universal laws. New law. All laws must be made by Reddit and you, smegma on demand. Totally gross by the way. Has to be glad about the monsieur. All commercials, TV shows, movies, etc. must have audio set at the same volume. Edit, equalized asterisk at the same volume. We'll be right back after a quick commercial break. Hashtag H-I-B-I-L-L-Y-M-A-Y-S-H-E-R-E. Instead of war politicans have to end their arguments with a Yu-Gi-Oh duel that is streamed worldwide. Great, now Asia always wins wars. Three days of work, two of relaxation, two of learning more things, hobbies, languages or whatever. Be kind, to each other, to yourself, to animals, to the earth. Just fucking be kind. It isn't even hard, it's so easy, German children are even kinder. High fives are the new mandatory form of introduction. It's more fun that way. This would be great. I don't think I've ever given a high five without smiling. The moon will now be referred to as menstruation master. So the moon was the first blood bender then. Treat others how you want to be treated. God, I wish that hot girl over there would just walk over and start fucking me. I want to die so. Don't be a dick to animals. But what if one of them is a dick to me? Is defense dickness acceptable? Dick fence is alright, but not on weekends after 7 p.m. Owning other humans as property is illegal. Imagine all the people living life in peace. For every hour you post on social media your political opinions, you need to spend an hour listening to the counter-argument. Edit. Thanks for the silver and the long debate on a comment I just pulled out of my ass. So if you argue that windmills do not in fact cause cancer you would make someone spend an hour listening to the case that they do cause cancer? If you're going to spend that much time on social media talking about how windmills don't cause cancer, then yes I'm okay with it. Stop, polluting, you morons. Also littering, any amount, is punishable by public shaming at the very least, and community service, and a fine sexually abusing children punishable by death. As much as I respect this sentiment, isn't it actually dangerous to children to punish sexual abuse child rape with death? If person assaults a child, why take the chance of leaving the child alive so that they can rat them out? If A is going to die if they get caught for sexual assault the same that they would die if they get caught for killing a child. Why not just kill them after they assault the child and leave no witnesses? That being said, I hope child predators all die a painful death. Yeah, that's why rape charges have to be lighter than murder charges. Even if rape is worse in terms of moral justification. Chew with your goddamned mouth shut. I read this as chew with your goddamned mouth slut. You are not allowed to report something you know to be false as news or publicly promote purposely misleading information. 
Everything must be fact-checked before reporting, and opinion pieces are not allowed in print or broadcast that is interpreted as news. You have to say, in my pants, after every sentence. You broke your own law in my pants. OMG you're right in my pants. There's a great joke in my pants shit. In my pants commas work better in my pants. That sounded pretty nice in my pants. If you know you are contagious of a deadly virus but still go to crowded areas, you should be locked up. Edit. Thanks for the gold kind stranger. EIDT2. Sorry no gold. Thought I saw one. Paid sick leave for everybody is the better alternative. When you're done with the weights, asterisk asterisk re-rack them. Asterisk asterisk. I found my president. Vaccines are mandatory with a doctor's approval. If you refuse to get your child vaccinated without valid reason, s, it will be taken off you and vaccinated anyway. Some children can't be vaccinated so might want to refine the parameters on that one. Oh yeah, forgot about allergies one sec. Not even just that, vaccines are also harmful for people without functioning immune systems in poor specific areas of the body in terms of immune response. If I were you, I'd say let make it mandatory for a doctor to evaluate if you can get the child vaccinated safely. And if so it's legally required. Quit being duty heads. Be excellent to each other, Tilda Bill and Ted. Use your fucking turn signal. Exclamation mark. Exclamation mark exclamation mark exclamation mark exclamation mark. That's already a law. No repost of this format. Pay me a 0.1% income tax annually. I did the math and it would be about $43 billion annually give or take. All plastics must be biodegradable now. Within a certain time period. Depending on product. Single-use plastics must biodegrade in 9 months. Well, you've completely fucked the whole medical industry. Enjoy the huge rise of preventable sickness and death. Self-defense is now legal. That's fine. Now define being attacked. God damn that's a good response. It's what makes something that should be simple complicated. It's actually frustrating. Welcome to anything even remotely pertaining to the law. You do not talk about Fight Club. No Karens allowed and the employee is allowed to act the way the customer treats the monsieur. I feel bad for the legitimately sweet and nice women out there who happen to be named Karen. There's a woman I have known since I was in kindergarten who is practically a second mother to me. That woman wouldn't raise her voice to anyone. Poor good Karens. Having their name ruined by bad Karens. Hashtag not all Karens. Clean water is a human right. Fuck you Nestle. Indoctrinating children into religious institutions is now child abuse. Where would the line be drawn for indoctrination? Would small talk about religion count as indoctrination? What about having a religious book sitting out in the house? Say a religion was just a natural part of the community, and as a result, the child grew up in it. Is that indoctrination, or merely culture? Pinning down indoctrination in anything but the extreme cases is pretty hard. Is indoctrination into atheism illegal? If not then 80% of the world is against you. You literally cannot be indoctrinated into the lack of a subscriptive religious belief. Atheism is simply the rejection of religious doctrine. Either you subscribe to it. You've been indoctrinated into a particular religious doctrine. Or you don't. Similarly, you can't be indoctrinated into not having the stamp collecting hobby. There is no doctrine associated with not collecting stamps. Teaching kids that religion doesn't exist is still indoctrination. I happen to disagree here. Not because I think indoctrination by parents is bad, but because I think enforcement of said rule by the state is likely worse. Treat others how you want to be treated. It's such a simple rule but no one fucking follows it. We make it a law. Then they gotta. I want my boss to pay me $50 per hour, so I'm going to pay him $50 per hour. Yeah, what a simple rule. It kinda means don't be a dick to people. Worth adding to your rule book I'd say. Make it so school lunches aren't prison meals. Seriously. What is wrong with the food they serve us? 
mine is actually good. Circular pizza and soft pretzels plus Gatorade and Cheetos. Yep, them's all the food groups. Put your litter in the fucking bin. I see so many areas with litter in the grass, in ponds, etc. And it just baffles me. I would make All Star the anthem of all the humanity. Don't we mean the Soviet Union national anthem as Karadar anthem? You must say, kitty, when you see a cat, or, cows, when you drive past a field of them. You have to say the animal species whenever you see it, could help with land gauges. No fat chicks. This is pretty much a thing in like all of Asia. Thou is required to come to my birthday. Thou does not have to bring a gift. I am just very lonely. Happy birthday. Ah, thank you kind soul for now that I have friends it will be a happy day. Kill any stink bug you come across. Hate those things. Close my door when you leave my room and if my light was off and you turned it on. Turn. It. Off. Weed is okay. Clearly, you haven't seen my lawn. Same sex marriage is now legal everywhere. And they can adopt. Please. I live in Alabama. Was a social worker for 10 years. My only adoptions to gay couples were children who had terminal illnesses. Meaning at the time these couples had no right to marry and their children were going to die. Now gay couples can't adopt at all. This state would rather kids have no family than have gay parents. It's cruelty at its finest. Government shouldn't even be involved in marriage at all. Freedom of speech. Hey, you can't say that here. I had to scroll way too far to find this, you guys. Probably something like work together to save this planet. Not to be that guy, but that's not a law, just a sentiment. Good luck trying to enforce that. No TikTok. Don't be a dick or you lose yours. I already lost mine. Well, guess it's time to be a dick. Got any advice? Guess you won't be needing that miniature version of yourself down there. So do women get two chances to be boobs? It's illegal to be Piers Morgan. You need to pass a PhD level test in order to run for president of any country. The test should cover knowledge related to civics and government, history, foreign policy, macroeconomics, civil rights. To become an industrial climber fixing electric wind turbines you need to do all sorts of safety and climbing certifications. To drive a car you need to get a license. It makes sure you know that lives are in your hands each time you take the wheel. To govern a country, perhaps even have the finger on nuclear bombs having the lives of millions in your hands. Just be born here and be greater than X years old. Insane. 4chan has complete power over all governments for one hour in a random day every year. Are you trying to kill us all? Question mark exclamation mark. Yes he is. We better run for our lives. Close every tax loophole. So no taxes? Fantastic. I love it. Don't be an asshole. I will be the whole ass. Free services for anyone suffering from any kind of mental health disorder. Ban smoking cigarettes in public. My body my choice. Yeah, as long as you're somewhere other people or children can't breathe it, you should be able to. Smokers are just an added healthcare expense that my country has to pay for, for no good reason. Exactly. Nah smoking gets me through the day. Asterisk ban the production of cigarettes. If you want to make mass scale change without penalizing people's personal liberty. You can't play music out loud in public transport places. Second amendment for everyone. Second amendment for Americans would be a good start. I'ma drop the 11th commandment on y'all, thou shalt not be a furry. Prospective parents must undergo a brief but thorough test to see if for adequate caretakers. And will have to attend a course on parenting otherwise. You are only allowed to have a child if you have a permit which says you are suitable to care for. The Monsieur. Edit. Spelling mistakes. Sounds like eugenics with extra steps. How you going to handle an accidental pregnancy? Forced abortion? Yes, s. Show respect for each other, please for fuck's sake please. I respectfully ask that you shut the fuck up. How is that? Just adding the word respectfully doesn't make your request respectful. Wow it's almost like he was joking. 
No open mouth chewing. Thank you so much for watching and have a good day.